You can so play. Stefano the Super Cruiser welcomes you to Thomas and Friends Truckmaster Races. Everybody pick your favorite engine. Golden Thomas, Hyperglow Ashima, Rebecca, Spencer, Celebration Percy, Young Bao, Gina, Busy as a Bee James, Armor Thomas, Hero, Lorenzo, Neon Edward, Dirty Diesel, Gordon, Celebration Thomas, and look what we have here. Helping us celebrate Thomas and Friends 75th anniversary is Celebration Nia. She looks fast, she looks shiny, she looks like she should be carrying something in her cargo. Let's open her up. Celebration Nia, she is light and she is shiny, folks. She comes with a shiny car. It has those two little pegs in it, meaning we could put in a monkey in there, not included. Think we can fit this guy in here, William? Maybe that African elephant? Yeah, he fits in there pretty good too. That's not included either, but... She, is he eating the coal? Yeah. Nia. Yeah. Drink, 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 drink. That, drink that's drink, even worse. Drink, what do you think? Drink, I think this drink, might drink, be my favorite Nia. Drink, what do you think? Drink, drink. Okay. And that elephant is now out of the picture, apparently. She looks really shiny, really just bold, beautiful face. I love Nia. Anyways, let's get her racing. As always, today's winner will receive a Thomas and Friends Minis blind bag. And he's grabbing one right now, folks. Oh, is that the one that's good, that they're gonna win? I don't think that one wants to be won. Okay, we'll grab that one instead. First race, Liam, who will you have racing? Spencer versus Rebecca. A couple of streamlined steamies. Rebecca representing the steam team and Spencer representing the mainland. On your marks, get set, go! Off they go, and here they are, neck and neck as all. Rebecca takes a slight lead over the Super Cruiser. As they're going up and they will come down quickly, looks like Spencer has the inside track giving him a slight advantage and that was enough to take the lead over Rebecca. Spencer Streamy, he is going through and he will win. Rebecca is eliminated. Wow, Rebecca, we always expect her to do well, but not today. Spencer has eliminated her already. Next up, it's the race of the red engines, but one is yellow. Young Bao of China versus Busy as a Bee James from the Beehive. On your marks, get set, go! And here they go, and it looks like Busy as a Bee James, oh my goodness, he is well ahead of Young Bao. It looks like the bee is taking out the tiger. He has the outside track, but I don't think that'll be enough for Young Bao to catch him. Busy as a Bee James still in first place, outpacing Young Bao. And he is coming over the Super Cruiser, will go through and get the win. Second race, second upset. Busy as a B James. We've had this guy for a long time. He's taken out Young Bao of China. My goodness. Next up, it's another tender battle as Hero of the Rails, all the way from Japan, takes on Lorenzo, the musical engine from Italy. On your marks, get set, go! Lorenzo, my goodness. Oh, Hero struggling to, he didn't need a push to go up the hill. Lorenzo, I think this is gonna be a malfunction at the junction. He's got the outside track, but that is not gonna be enough for Hero, who now is coming down and he is deadlocked. Look at that, he doesn't even have enough strength to push on Lorenzo. So we'll give him the right away and we'll hold on to Lorenzo for a second just to show you how much of a lead he has as he goes over the Super Cruiser and all takes the win back to Italy. Lorenzo, no stranger to the Super Cruiser, has gotten the win. Hero of Japan goes back empty handed. Next up, it's another Italian battle as Gina of Italy takes on Armored Thomas, who looks very Roman if you ask me. He's surprised that he has to face Gina. On your marks, get set, go! And they're pretty evenly matched. I think Gina might have a slight advantage, but don't give up on Armored Thomas yet. As they come around, it looks like Armand ha Thomas sorry, has the inside track, which will give him a bit of an advantage. And I think they were going too close for Gina to catch up. Armand Thomas now definitely ahead, coming over to Super Cruiser. Gina's catching up, but it's not enough 
as his helmet gets caught at the finish line. Well, that was very interesting, but in the end, Armor Thomas looks like he is the tougher of the two and has eliminated Gina, a past champion. Well, Liam wants to race our newest engine. It is Celebration Nia, and she's going up against Neon Edward. I think that she might have actually replaced him on the Steam Team old Edward Blue. Let's see how he does. On your marks, get set, go! Nia now definitely ahead of Edward as she's going on over the Super Cruiser, and she has a very distinct advantage. Oh, but she's got the outside track. Will it be enough? It looks like Edward got derailed. Oh my goodness, he's back on track and on time, but Nia takes full advantage, and she is well ahead at this point. Super shiny. She goes on to win, my goodness. And Celebration Nia, super shiny, has taken out Neon Edward. Orange over blue. Woohoo! Classic rivals Diesel versus Steamy. Dirty versus Clean. Villain versus Hero. It is Dirty Diesel going up against Celebration Thomas. On your marks. Get set. Go! And off the bat, it looks like Rubble Diesel or Dirty Diesel is actually a little bit behind Celebration Thomas being in front. And he has the outside track. This might be a great equalizer. Will Diesel be able, and he does pull out in the front, but Will Celebration Thomas looks very close. He's catching up and they look almost nose to nose, neck to neck, Celebration Thomas pulls ahead, who will win it? Oh my goodness, it was Diesel! Devious, Dirty Diesel and his dirty tricks has somehow defeated Celebration Thomas. I think he came down the hill a little bit faster. Oh no, Thomas. All shiny and blue and goodbye to you. Next up, let's have Golden Thomas celebrating 75 years, going up against Hyperglow Ashima of India, one of the most underrated engines in our railway. On your marks. Get set, go! And off they go, neck to neck, nose to nose. Looks like a Shima slightly ahead of Golden Thomas. Oh no, but she's falling down. Thomas comes around. What will happen here? It's super close, but it looks like Golden Thomas slightly ahead. I can't believe that a Shima has fallen off. She was slightly in the lead, but Golden Thomas has lost to celebrate. He goes through, and Ashima got stuck. You never know what's gonna happen here on Kids Toys Play. Golden Thomas. Celebrating, he was losing, I think, to Glow in the Dark Ashima, but ultimately he got ahead and got the win. Final race of the first round has another Steam Team battle. Celebration, Percy, shiny and green, takes on Gordon, regular Gordon, one of our favorites, strongest and best. He pulls the express. On your marks, get set, go! Off they go. I think Gordon might have had a whoa celebration, Percy though, definitely going ahead, showing that mail cars. Go faster than the Express sometimes. Gordon coming out of the turn slightly ahead. Will Celebration Percy catch up? I think he's catching up already as he's nose to tender. It's all down the hill and who's gonna, oh my goodness. Celebration Percy, the faster of the two, but Gordon took advantage of that inside track and eliminated him going on to the next round. And welcome to the second round, folks, as Gordon, Celebration Nia, Lorenzo, Golden Thomas, Spencer, Dirty Diesel, Busy as it be, James, and Armored Thomas remain. Who will win? Special request, the very first race will have Gordon up against Spencer, a rematch from their great race. These two are always racing. On your marks, get set, go! And here they are, the two biggest tender engines. Gordon pulling ahead of Spencer, oh no! Will Gordon get the inside track? And he does, and that's gonna give him a distinct advantage coming out. He is definitely ahead of Spencer at this point. Gordon coming over, back over the Super Cruiser. You can see how far ahead he is of Spencer, and it's too late for you. Gordon showing off that big strength from the Express has eliminated Mighty Spencer, oh no. Next up, it is two of our newest engines here on Kids Toys Play at Celebration Nia. Takes on Armor Thomas. Let's see who the fastest in the Steam Team is. On your marks. Get set, go! Looks like Nia might have had a little bit of a head start, but it is no over, oh no! She quickly got derailed. Will it be enough? Oh, she has to take the high road. This is gonna give a distinct advantage to Armor Thomas. Will Celebration Nia be able to catch up? We're not too sure Armor Thomas going loud and proud and very fast. And he goes on and oh no, he has won! And Nia having problems staying on track proves to be her downfall as Armored Thomas is shocked that he has won. Next up, it's another Thomas, Golden Thomas, celebrating his 75th birthday, going up against Lorenzo, the musical engine from Italy. On your marks, get set, 
Go! And here they are, and it is Lorenzo. But here comes, oh no, he got stuck trying to get up that hill up the Super Cruiser. And Golden Thomas takes advantage, but he is back in the lead as he has raced on the hill. And coming out of the turns, looking like Golden Thomas now slightly ahead of Lorenzo. What a very close race. Lorenzo having problems going up the hill, but he is going extra fast down the hill, and that is what has made him win. Oh wow! Most exciting race so far, back and forth, but Lorenzo's ability to go down hills at speed has eliminated Golden Thomas, who has nothing to celebrate. And the final race of this round has Dirty Diesel, eliminate, who eliminated Celebration Thomas last race. Up against Busy as it be, James, who's very surprising that, made it, that he made it this far. On your marks, get set, go! And here they are, and it looks very nose to nose, neck to neck. I think that James was slightly ahead. Oh no, oh, Diesel! Let's try to get him back on track as soon as we can. And he takes the outside very close, but James definitely ahead at this point. Diesel off in the distance, not having much fun at all. James, oh no, this is just unreal how quickly he has eliminated Dirty Diesel. Busy as a B, James has taken out Diesel. Holy smokes, another win for the Steam Team. And here we are, the final four, folks. Gordon, Busy as a B, James, Lorenzo, and Armored Thomas. Three of these engines blue, and three of them are members of the Steam Team. This should be interesting. I don't know who's going to win. Who do you think is going to win, William? Lorenzo. Lorenzo? I'm gonna go with Armor Thomas. Liam's pick, Lorenzo, will go up against Busy as a B James first, as these two tender engines decide who's gonna be fastest. On your marks, get set, go! And here they go, Lorenzo coming up fast and strong. Busy as a B James hot on his tail, but Lorenzo, very quick, he gets the outside track though, and I think that James might be slightly ahead, but that takes no time. Lorenzo now catching up, he has a great time going down. Won't be enough though, as here comes James and Lorenzo has been eliminated. Floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee. Busy as a bee, James might win the mini. And who will he face in the final? Let's find out as Gordon, strong and proud, takes on Armored Thomas, who is always confused. On your marks, get set, go! And off they go, these two are going ahead. Looks like Gordon slightly ahead is Armored Thomas. Comes into the turns. Gordon taking that hill very fast, but so did Thomas. They go into the big turns now. And Armor Thomas will end up slightly ahead. Will it be enough for Gordon to catch up? I don't know if Armor Thomas, a full train length ahead as he goes down. Gordon tries to pass him, but it's not enough. Thomas still in shock as that helmet of his has proven lucky. He has eliminated mighty Gordon and will go on to the final. And here is the final, folks. Stefano the Super Cruiser with that Thomas and Friends minis. As busy as a B, James takes on Armored Thomas, one versus five in the Steam Team battle. Who will be the fastest track master on Sodor? On your marks, get set, go! And here they are, Armored Thomas slightly ahead. Busy as a B, James catching up. They're coming around. I think busy as a B might be slightly ahead as he gets the inside lane and Armored Thomas will get the outside. That gives a distinct advantage. To busy as it be, James Armor Thomas hot on his tail though, but coming in to the final Super Cruiser on the big push, and that is all over, folks. In unbelievable fashion, I can't believe it. Busy as it be, James. I don't think anybody picked this guy, but congratulations if you picked him. He has eliminated Armor Thomas, and we'll get that Thomas and Friends mini surprise bag. Liam, who do you think it's going to be? Cowboy Diesel. Veronica, who do you think it's going to be? Cowboy Emily. And I think it's going to be Cowboy Thomas. Who is this? This is a guy with a mustache and he's got some... Cowboy Ferdinand. Is this Cowboy Ferdinand? Mm -hmm. It is a cowboy, but not the one we wanted. It is a cowboy, not the one we wanted. You're absolutely right. Cowboy Ferdinand. This is our first Ferdinand ever. He's got the mustache. He's got some kind of Scottish banner on there that looks like a tartan of some sort. And he's got a gold mine. He's got a pick and he's got some gold on there. A couple of pockets on his roof because he's wearing jeans I guess like a real cowboy. Nice colors, blue and gold for the wheels with a silver body. I think that we're happy to have him and we're lucky to have him. Congratulations, welcome to the channel Cowboy Ferdinand. Congratulations, busy as it be James. You know he didn't race with his antenna and he won. Maybe that antenna's been holding him back all these years. I don't know. 